Nombulelo Moluma lives in the rural district of Ngalala. She's a mother and an entrepreneur. Nombulelo has her very own internet service business, where she offers members of the community the ability to communicate via email, do their banking, surf the web, research school or university projects, participate in social activities, access government grants and services, look for work and unlock other economic opportunities. Nombulelo is one of the several village operators who form a vital part of the Broadband for All initiative run by CSIR Meraka Institute and its partners. The absence of internet connectivity in South Africa is especially prevalent in its vast rural areas. Of the 26,500 schools in South Africa, about 17,000 are in remote rural villages and these have limited or no access to digital communication facilities such as the internet, landlines, mobile phones or fax machines. In response to this pressing problem, the CSIR Miraka Institute and its partners embarked on Broadband for All, a project which aims to provide affordable broadband connectivity to these underserviced rural communities. The initiative is sponsored by the South African Department of Science and Technology. Um, connectivity brings economic development. According to the World Bank, for every 10% increase in broadband, you get a 1-2% to increase in um, economic growth or GDP. The first phase saw the successful connectivity of 200 schools in the Nkangala district, while phase 2 will connect about another 250 facilities, such as clinics and schools to the internet and each other. This broadband uh, project has made it easier for the school. We have even seen the results has improved year by year. We are having improved the results. The benefit here is that our circuit is vast. It reduces traveling and it makes submissions to be easier and quicker. And if we could have all our schools connected and all our principals able to check emails, send emails, we would also be able to send out uh, circulars. They would reach schools in no time. At the centre of the Broadband for All initiative is the CSIR-developed Broadband Mesh Network. It makes use of high-performance nodes, or HPNs, to establish peer-to-peer -peer communication within the network. The network is comprehensively monitored and supported by a dedicated support desk. Government departments and agencies, universities, manufacturers, national operators, policymakers and SMMEs all have a role to play in rural connectivity. Its ongoing success relies greatly on these dynamic partnerships. The village operators form an integral part of this ecosystem. They are young local entrepreneurs with a keen interest in ICT who are empowered and mentored to run their own internet service within their local communities. Nombulelo's business has enabled her to deliver value-added services such as computer training for women, fax and copy and e-filing services to her community. Today, Nombulelo and other village operators like Mpomashu, Timothy Sikhopolo, Tumelo Miepa and Pila Malele have become proud change agents in their communities, stimulating development, helping small business, training others on internet use, promoting local business and developing a valuable support and knowledge network amongst themselves. This internet cafe, it's, it's, it's the best thing that has ever happened to my community. So most of the people, they come here to apply for jobs and they get jobs. But now I have this business, I can provide for my family. It brings life to me. It has added value to my life, to my family. The success of young ICT entrepreneurs such as Nombulelo echoes the point that true impact through technology requires human passion, dedication and commitment. It is one of the key components that enable initiatives such as Broadband for All to make great strides in the journey to a digitally inclusive South Africa.